Good morning, I'm Echo and today I'm going to show you how to make some pita bread. Pita bread is one of those things that seems super intimidating but actually it's pretty easy to make. You can stuff some falafel into these pita pockets, turn them into pita sandwiches or simply enjoy them with some fresh homemade hummus. With only 4 simple ingredients, this is the easiest and inexpensive flatbread you can make without an oven. So, let's get started! Good morning, I'm Echo and welcome to Echo's Kitchen! Here are the ingredients. For the sponge mix, we'll need a cup of warm water, a package of dry yeast, and a cup of all-purpose flour. We'll also need 2 tablespoons of olive oil, some salt, and 2 more cups of all-purpose flour. In a bowl, combine 1 cup of all-purpose flour and 2 and 1 4 teaspoon of dry yeast. Stir and add the warm water. Stir to combine and let it sit for about 10 to 15 minutes. When the sponge mixture starts to bubble and begin to appear foamy, it's time to add in 1 teaspoon of salt and a tablespoon of olive oil into the sponge. Mix well, then add 1 and 3 4 cups of all-purpose flour. Mix the dough until soft and slightly sticky. If the dough sticks to the sides of the bowl, add some more flour. Now, sprinkle some flour into a clean workspace and begin to knead the dough. Knead for about 5 to 6 minutes and form the dough into a ball. Brush some olive oil into a large bowl and transfer the dough in it. Slightly brush the top part of the dough with some olive oil and cover with a clean wrap. Cover with a clean kitchen towel and let it rest for 2 hours. When the dough has doubled in size, it should look like this. Sprinkle some flour onto the dough and onto a clean workspace. Remove the dough from the bowl and lightly pat into a flat shape. Using a knife, cut the dough into 8 equal pieces. Now it's time to form each piece into a small round ball with a smooth top. Place them into a flour pan. Sprinkle some flour on top. Cover with a clean wrap and a clean kitchen towel and let it rest for 30 minutes. When they have risen, flour a rolling pin and then turn onto the flour workspace. Gently pat the dough with your fingers. With the use of a rolling pin, form a flat round dough. Just like this. Repeat the process and let the flat round dough rest for 5 minutes. Over medium heat, Brush the pan with olive oil. Lay the pita bread into the hot pan and cook until bread begins to puff and the bottom has brown spots. Flip and cook for 2 more minutes. Stack the cooked pita breads on the bread basket. You can let them cool or serve them warm with some creamy homemade hummus or Greek tomato dip. You can check out my Facebook page or YouTube channel to learn how to make a homemade hummus. There you have it, our homemade pita bread. Enjoy! Thank you for watching. Please like and share this video. I will post more cooking vlogs every week. So I hope you will share my Facebook page to your friends. And please consider to subscribe to my YouTube channel as well. Thank you for your support and I'll see you guys soon.
拜。